Finding a formula that benefits the athletes was the main reason behind ISA's decision to stick with last year's schedule for the 2023 staging of the ISA Grace Kennedy Boys and Girls Championships. The launch for the five-day spectacle took place on Wednesday evening at the National Stadium, which will also host the March 28 to April 1 event. Following the 2020 cancellation and the two subsequent years of tweaks and adjustments due to the COVID-19 pandemic, this year's staging of the ISA Grace Kennedy Boys and Girls Athletics Championships will mark the first fully executed version of the famous event since 2019. 20,000 spectators were permitted last year, but this time around, the full capacity of the national stadium will be utilized. Luckily, we have a template that we were using up to 20, 2019, and that, that template we think worked, but we always want to improve, and therefore would have put in the extra effort to see what is it we could do better this year. Um, we wouldn't necessarily just want to go back to 2019, and therefore we have tried a few things in terms of our planning, and we'll see how it pans out. The format will also be the same as last year, with the 100-meter finals for all classes to be contested on the Wednesday, the second day of the championships. And we felt that the schedule best suits the athletes at this point in time. There are other considerations that we would have discussed, but we thought that we should give it at least another year to see how things work out and to ensure that we continue to look out for the athletes' best interests. Because I think there's no doubt at all that the schedule as it is, is a perfect fit for the athletes. 88 teams on the boys' side and 91 in the girls' category have been registered to compete. The winning boys and girls' teams will each receive $1 million from ISA. Title sponsor Grace Kennedy will also offer $250,000 to the winning coaches of the champion schools, as well as two teachers, one being nominated from either school. Grace Kennedy will also provide a digital technology grant of $500,000 to the boys and girls teams, which break the most records at the meet. Kingston College and Edwin Allen are the defending boys and girls champions, respectively. Meanwhile, the various platforms of the RGR Gleaner Group will have blanket coverage of the five-day championship. Championships. TVJ, TVJSN, Hits 92 FM, Power 106 FM, and of course, One Spot Media are serious about the development of sports, in particular track and field. And that's why Boys and Girls Championships represents an investment of over $50 million for us. We are committed to bringing you the most comprehensive, exciting, and innovative coverage of the event from the start on Tuesday morning, March 28th, to the final race and the closing ceremony on Saturday evening on April 1. The championships will run from 9 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. on the first four days and 1 to 9 p.m. on the final day. Spencer Darlington, TVJ Sports.